Check the pulse. It's disturbing new video, the last minutes of George Floyd's life, as witnesses desperately plead with cops to get off his neck. We are blurring Floyd's face because he may already be deceased. Bro, he has not moved, not one time. He's off. The Floyd family lawyer, Benjamin Crump, released the tape, calling it beyond disturbing, even harder to watch than the first video. Minutes tick by, the crowd begs the police to let up. Like, bro, three minutes, bro, he's not moving. The first video that provoked all these days of street protests and civil unrest focused on Officer Derek Chauvin, who kneeled on Floyd's neck for eight minutes and 46 seconds. But this new video focuses more on Officer Totau. His demeanor outrages the witnesses. He's just gonna let him keep his hand on his neck, bro? You're a bro. Tao, you gonna keep, you gonna let him keep that like that? You gonna let him kill that man in front of you, bro? Officer Tao's role in this is very troubling. Seth Coben is a lawyer representing the teenager who shot the first video. He was the only person really in a position to do anything about it. Not only does he not do anything about it, he barely even glances over to see uh, what Mr. Floyd's condition was. And the look on his face is utterly cold and heartless. It only came to an end when an ambulance pulls up and Floyd's apparently lifeless body is taken to the hospital. Chauvin has been charged with second degree murder. Officer Tao has been charged with aiding and abetting second degree murder, along with two other officers. Now, legendary singer Barbara Streisand has reached out to Floyd's six year old daughter, Gianna, sending the little one an unknown amount of stock in the Disney company. On Instagram, Gianna wrote, Thank you, Barbara Streisand. I am now a Disney stockholder thanks to you.